What's up everyone? This is Rakesh here. Once again, welcome to the session of Oracle SQL. So in this session, we are going to understand what all the pseudo columns available in the Oracle database and what exactly the pseudo column is. So that is a topic which we are going to see in this session. So let's begin. So guys, what is pseudo column? Pseudo column is nothing but it's an inbuilt column which is available in every table. Okay. And this column is provided by by default Oracle. You do not need to uh create separately or you do not need to insert the value into this columns okay so whenever you create a record into the table this columns will be automatically will get filled okay so that is nothing but your pseudo column now what are the types of pseudo column available or what are the uh, pseudo column available in the oracle database so the very first one is nothing but your row id row id will be the address of the your uh, call, uh, row okay and the second one is your row num row number is, is nothing but it's a numbering one two three four five row number it will show okay and leveling that i will explain in the uh, practical session okay and then next one is nothing but your curve l and the next well so these are the two uh, pseudo columns related to your sequence okay so that all the things we are going to understand in a practical okay so let's go for the practical So guys now let's see the practical session of the pseudo column over here first i would like to discuss row num and the row id okay so for that i need to describe the employee table and i need to show you all the columns of the employee table so guys as you can see over here these are the uh, columns are available in the employee table okay however i am over here selecting the row num and the row id you can see over here however it was not present in the employee table but how i can select which is not available uh, in the employee table but i can select it so guys i can say that these are the special columns which is available by default in every table of the uh, oracle database okay so row num and the row id is nothing but it's a inbuilt column which is provided by by default oracle okay guys so uh, what exactly the row num and row id row num is nothing but it is a numbering of the row okay you can see over here 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 and what exactly the row id row id is nothing but it is a address where exactly my row this row is residing or let me over here do star okay so over here it tells that uh, it tells that let me do over here a dot star a dot star over here okay so what exactly it will do it will tell that where exactly this row is residing in the disk so this is nothing but your pointer or address of an this row okay and this is nothing but your uh, numbering of the rows 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 so i hope you have understood what exactly the row num and row id is now moving on to the next uh, pseudo column which is nothing but your next well and the curve well so curve well and the next well is associated with the sequence so when we use the sequence and when we create the sequence at that time only we can use this pseudo column so let me create first sequence over here and then we will use this okay so over here you can see over here um, uh, it is giving some value okay now if i will again run this again run this query then what it will do it is incrementing let me run one more time it will increment by two so if i will increment each time then it will give the next 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 value and it will give the current value if i will run this one then it will give the only current value only let me run one more time so as many times as many times as you can run but it will give the same value but it will increment the next value so next value is nothing but it will give the next value of an, uh, this sequence and the curve value is nothing but it will give the current value of an, uh, this sequence and how you can use this so first you need to create the sequence and then you have to write in the select clause this is how so in the select clause you have to write the first sequence number or sequence name and then pseudo column and then from statement and then over here you can mention 
table so over here i have mentioned the employ uh, dual table over here you can mention the employee table as well so let me mention over here employee table so you can see over here this many sequences got created okay but in practical uh, in live environment we always use with the dual because it has the only one row and one column so you can see over here it created the one uh, it, it got incremented with the around 50 correct because it has the 50 rows so uh, we have the uh, it got executed by 50 times because in the employee table we have the let me show, show you how many records is there so that is the reason it is showing that much so count over here and then let me show you so that many times that sequence next 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 is got executed 55 times got executed so that's the reason it is showing this much big number now if i will run this then it will increment by one only one more time because uh, dual table has the only one record let me show you the dual table as well however i have made the video on the dual table last time only so you can see over here dual table has only one column and one row so this is what the importance of the dual table also so guys i hope you have understood what exactly the next one and the curve value. curve value will give the current value next value will give the next value okay now moving on to the next pseudo column which is nothing but your level so level always we will use with the uh, when we have the labeling kind of stuff okay so you can see over here we, we can use the level with the connect by prior okay so it will give the leveling so we, whether it is root or child or child of child something like that uh, at that time we will uh, give use the uh, level and it is most of the times we use when we use the analytical function so you can see over here it is giving the level one level two three so level can be understand when we understand the uh, connect uh, connect by prior uh, this this uh, this uh, keyword or i can say this functionality if we understand then then we can understand properly what exactly this so you can understand just right now uh, level is nothing but it is uh, giving the level so let's say for example you can assume that we have the hierarchy uh, in which we have the tree uh, in which we have root or root and then uh, child and then child and then child something like that it will give the leveling number okay so uh, we will understand level in detail when we understand the connect by prior uh, this functionality okay guys so this is the uh, pseudo column and i hope you have understood now let me show you some more uh, pseudo column which is provided by by default oracle okay so these are the pseudo columns are available and you can go on this website and you can check it okay and i will give the link of this website in the description box so if you want to understand all these uh, pseudo columns in detail then you can go and you can check it out but uh, in my life uh, 10 years of experience i didn't used it all these things uh, whatever i have explained over here these are the only pseudo columns i have used in my life okay guys but it depends again on your requirement so that's all for the day and this is what the pseudo column is so guys i hope you have understood what exactly the pseudo column is and if you have any feedback then please don't forget to let me know in the comment box thank you so much for watching for the video bye bye take care